Stephanie Marco, thank you for joining us on WGC. Today we are at number 10 of our weight loss series. So congratulations if you've made it this far. If you're just starting with number 10 and skipping around, this particular exercise is great for burning fat and moving prana through the body using bow pose and a variation of bow pose where we'll be in motion and um, we'll be really gentle with ourselves. It's a great way to warm up during the day, in the morning. It's a great little exercise to add to your existing practice. So let's start. So please come seated into a nice, comfortable position, feeling your body relaxed. The lower spine and the sit bones are grounded into the floor and tucked under. The chest is wide, the belly's relaxed, shoulders are up and back, and the eyes are closed. Inward and upward, focused at the third eye point. And just bring your hands together. You can rub them a bit and get the energy moving. Bringing the thumbs to the chest. And just creating a space to allow the conscious mind to fall away, to bring yourself a new awareness inside. Taking a nice deep inhale, filling the belly with air. And exhale, releasing and allowing the belly to move back towards the spine as you let go. And with every Kundalini Yoga class, we chant Ong Namo Guru Dev Namo to tune in. And it means I bow to the teacher within me. So let's just bring ourselves into a nice, comfortable position, taking a nice deep inhale. And exhale and inhaling to tune in. Om Namo Guru Dev Namo yourself to go deeper within, dropping into the essence of yourself and your truth. And we're continuing our weight loss session and this is number 10 of the series and this is a great exercise using bow pose and you can incorporate it into any other practice that you have or meditation or just use it on its own for a quick little pick-me-up in the morning. Um, and bow pose is great at burning away extra fat. It can be quite challenging. It looks a little simple, but really when you hold it and you really breathe, you're really allowing the body to burn fat and to use prana in a much more accelerated way. So we're going to get into, onto our bellies with our chin on the floor. Hands are at the chest. And we're going to move into this bow pose starting first with our cobra. So pushing up into cobra, and then pulling back to the ankles. And rolling back and forth a little bit on the stomach here. 
And just letting your body flow, pulling on the ankles to kind of get a little movement going. And we're gonna do this for one minute. And we're gonna relax. And then we're gonna repeat it again. This is a great way to end a session or to get the body warmed up. And just really use your breath. And ladies, if this hurts at all, you want to make sure to just relax and be gentle with your body. Make sure you have a nice soft mat. Fifteen seconds. And hold. Inhale, really deep, squeeze, and exhale, release. Letting your body return to relaxed state. Feeling the tension, any blocks that you're holding, letting them go now. And when you're ready, putting the chin to the floor, hands are at the chest, moving yourself up into a cobra and releasing the hands to the ankles and gently rocking. With a relaxed breath. Ten more seconds. Inhale and hold it up. Squeeze and release. And this part of relaxing is just as important as the exercise itself. So keep bringing awareness to your body. Keep dropping into your intuition. And allow anything that needs to be released to be moved out of the body through the breath. Allow the earth to absorb anything you no longer need to carry. Let go.
and understanding that the doing of the masculine also needs the relaxation of the feminine. So really giving yourself this chance to relax and do nothing. And when you're ready, and slowly and gently bring yourself back to a seated position. For our closing satnam. Bringing the hands to the heart. Remembering your true self. And that's what satnam means. Truth is my identity. And we'll just chant it to close. Inhale. So.